It's National Kazoo Day and a Silent Reading Day. Your lunch options for today are grab list burrito, honey barbecue rib patty sandwich. Your sides for today are baked beans, sweet potato casserole, and fresh veggie tray. There has been plenty of evidence that premature gravy Raging caused by extreme stress and, and Harvard University scientists think they have a an answer. Union Station in downtown Indianapolis is the home of the Crown Plaza Hotel. This hotel is an old train car that you can sleep in for the night. There are 26 train car rooms that sleep two to four people. Microfoss is trying to go to green by 2030 and remove, the, and remove their carbon photo print. Now to Iman and Erica with the sports and weather. Thank you, Kevin and Caleb. The wrestling team has, has a match at Belzer tonight. Seven and eighth grade girls basketball also has a get an away game tonight against Center Grove North. The boys basketball season is now over. Congratulations to both seventh and eighth grade boys basketball. Now here's Jericho with the weather. Today's weather is the high of 35 degrees and the low is 29 degrees. Thanks, Iman and Derrica. Just a reminder, teachers that the technology office is closed until 11 o'clock today. So the students, if you are interested in playing in the baseball or softball league now, now it's time to sign up. Go to www.skillstest.com. This Saturday, the Lawrence Township School Students Foundation is hosting a kickball game event from 3 to 5 p.m. The cost is $5 and drinks and snacks are provi provided. This takes place at Belzer in invites all BMS, Fall Creek, LN, and LC students. To sign up, go to www.msd.org. Well, sir, we will have its first poetry contest. More information about it will be in tomorrow's broadcast. Today's random fact is ice cream ads is made out of mashed potatoes, so it won't melt. The quote of the day is by... Mr. HR who say, be willing to be behind you every single morning. The celebrity birthday for today is album producer Rick Ross. Now to Mr. Harsha with the rest of the morning announcements. Have a great day, Bruins. Good morning, Bruins. Just a couple quick announcements this morning. Uh, you guys heard about on the announcements there, there is a district uh, kickball tournament taking place this weekend uh, hosted by our Lawrence Township Student Foundation and that means that a lot of LC and LN students will be supervising that event. So students if you're interested check out their website. You can register online. It's five dollars. You get to kill hours uh, and have a lot of fun here in our main gym here at Belzer this weekend. I want to thank all of our teachers and students yesterday for um, doing our uh, second step curriculum. I know we don't typically do that on a Monday morning, but I really appreciate um, the way that students adjusted to that change. I visited five eighth grade classrooms yesterday and was extremely pleased with what I saw happening in classrooms, the great conversations that were happening about values, about uh, appropriate use of social media to communicate with peers, and sometimes the impact of our words, even if they are on a social media site or on a screen. So uh, just thank you so much to our teachers for your uh, rolling that curriculum out with integrity and also our students for engaging in that work. We appreciate you. A reminder again today that our WIDA testing begins for some of our students. And again, students, I want you to make sure that you are giving your absolute best effort and 100% focus to really demonstrate what you've learned and give us your absolute best effort on that assessment. Um, and then uh, the rest of the time this morning, we've got for our uh, sustained silent reading time. I know sometimes on Tuesdays and Thursdays we get rushed a little bit, but the remainder of the time we have this morning can be used for students to read silently. Thank you. Make it a great Tuesday.